hello friends now in this video we will discuss blur different options which we can find in the filter like here you can see blur and blur gallery so how you can use them like uh, for example if we select with uh, any selection tool this car I will select with the quick selection tool something like random and uh, then you know like if we click on select and inverse so Photoshop will select the opposite selection instead of car now uh, except of car everything is selected so go to filter and blur now here different options you can see like motion blur so motion blur if you apply you can see something like this so we can apply it see we have to select actually these tires as well so select the tires also and then apply this blur option so it will look more professional like motion blur you can see so as much you want you can apply then click ok Control D for deselect and you can see now the motion blur has been applied same thing like we have in the filter blur like um, radial blur for example amount you can select and the blur method the spin and quality is like draft good or best you can see something like this it will take time so different blurs here you can see one by one you can apply them and you can check how they will uh, apply so this is radial blur you can see something like this so filter blur in radial blur we can select the amount like less 10 and zoom and good see now it's less blur and looks good then we have in filter blur average so average like this filter blur 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 will apply a little bit blur then you can apply blur more so same thing like a box blur so box blur you can see something like this you can select the preview that how it will look then you can apply then gaussian blur it's something like this you can see all are you know something relevant blurs with each other you can see so here also we can apply see and uh, so these one by one you can apply or uh, something you can see this is surface blur and uh, in filter blur gallery if you apply one of them <coughs> sorry if you apply one of them you can see all of them here see all of them here so here we can select like field blur erase blur if you want to apply and uh, one more thing like in this you don't need to select like apply to entire image so it will look like this see it's up to you even if you want to apply to the selection you can apply to the selection as well from here we can extend the area all other area like you can see blur so this is still shift you can see and this is path blur and the last one is spin blur spin blur you can also see so like this these blurs we can apply so I hope you have learned a lot in this video about uh, the different options of blur how we can apply thank you very much for watching and please subscribe my channel